Money can't buy happiness. Money can't even buy trophies. But it might be able to buy James Tavernier as multiple outlets are reporting that Steven Gerrard is set to make a big transfer move for Rangers captain James Tavernier. Welcome back guys to Fog Football. And I think it's fair to say that James Tavernier, if you could compare him to something that is consumable, you would probably say he is Marmite. Some people love him, some people hate him. Some people think that he is vital to Rangers. Some people put the success that Rangers have had down to him. Others believe that he is a big part of the reason why Rangers haven't been more successful and that he's not a good captain and a better player, a better captain would have had more success at Rangers over the years. But regardless of what you think, there's no doubt that James Tavernier is an important player at the club. However, from next season, it looks like he might not be at the club because the Daily Record are reporting that multiple outlets, including some from Saudi Arabia, are reporting that Steven Gerrard is set to try and bring his former player and former captain to his team in the Saudi League Al Etafag. I believe it's Al Etafag. I don't really care for the Saudi League, so if I pronounced it wrong, Go and sue me, all right? Because I, I don't give a shit about your oil money league. And I think it's sad that all these big players, big managers are going out there. But, I mean, whatever. They can do what they want to do. Steven Gerrard's already there. Will we see James Tavernier join him? I mean, it is possible. Tavernier has spent a long time at Rangers. Like I said, he's either loved or he's either hated. If he won the title this season, it would be a good way to leave. It would be good to go in a high. But if he does win the league title, would he want to stay? Would the lure of Champions League football make Tavernier want to continue his Rangers career? I think so. I think Tavernier will not be happy with Rangers' um, sole adventure in the Champions League group stages since he's been at the club. That was an embarrassing campaign. I think Tavernier would be looking for a way to put that right. And if Rangers don't win the league then I believe Tavernier would still want to stay because I think he wouldn't want to leave when you've got Philippe Clement here, you've got Rangers currently rebuilding. I think Tav would want to be a part of this Rangers side and possibly go out as a winner and not a loser. So, I mean, I personally think Tavernier will stay. I think Tavernier will want to be a Rangers player next season. But if the money comes in, if Steven Gerrard does make a big money move, then... Who knows, money talks. James Tavernier's getting older. He probably doesn't have a big move left in him at this point in terms of quality. You know, I don't really see Tavernier moving up from Rangers. Now, there's no doubt about it. Going to the Saudi League is a downgrade, in my opinion, in terms of quality. But financially, it's a massive move. But I think if Tavernier was going to move to a bigger team or a better league, he would have probably already done it by now. So... I think the options for Tavernier are either stay at Rangers, maybe finish your career at Rangers, or at least stay for another few seasons, try and pad out the trophy cabinet, try and win as much as possible, or you can take that big money move to Saudi. There's a possibility though that money move to Saudi will still be there in a few years. Might not be available under Steven Gerrard, but... You know, the Saudi League is, is likely to be around for, for a while. So, I mean, I don't think it's now or never for James Tavernier in terms of making that move. But it looks like Gerard is set to be making big changes this season to his squad. And it appears that James Tavernier is someone that he would want. Now, Gerard's team is currently sitting in seventh spot at the moment, which isn't good enough. Uh, we know that Gerard and Tavernier had a good relationship. Uh, before Gerard left Rangers, he said the following about James Tavernier. He says, quote, People will talk about the assists and goals, but I judge James differently. I judge him on as soon as he walks through the door. What he's doing, is he helping me set the standards? Is he a professional in everything he does? Is he leading by example? Is he helping the young lads? Is he making sure everyone is at and the culture remains strong? End of quote. So, I mean, it looks like Gerard believes in Tavernier. He thinks he's more than just a, an assister. He thinks he's more than just a goal scorer. He thinks that he, he's an important part of any squad as a captain. And uh, Tavernier had the following to say 
about Stephen Gerrard after his exit for Rangers. He says, quote, We've achieved so much together. As a team, we have grown, demanded more from one another, but most importantly, we've developed into better players and better people. The club is in a place of that, I have no doubt, end of quote. So, I mean, Tavernier, Gerrard, I think they do like each other, got a lot of respect for each other. I have no doubt they would want to be reunited again. I just don't think it's the right move for James Tavernier. I think he can do better than the Saudi League, and I think he would regret it. His bank balance might not regret it, but in terms of his career, his playing career, I think it would be a bad move for him to make. So I, I think Tavernier should stay at Rangers. Uh, we will see, though. It seems like almost every season, James Tavernier is linked with moves away, whether it be to like England or whether it be to Saudi Arabia or anywhere. But, you know, every year he decides to stay at Rangers. Uh, will that happen again? Also, Tavernier said that him and Gerrard had a lot of success at Rangers. There's no doubt about it. Their title winning season was great in the league. But still, it was only one trophy out of nine. So I wouldn't say it was that much success. Uh, overall, in general, Tavernier's not had that much success at Rangers as a captain. His trophy cabinet is what got three trophies in it. He's got a League Cup, a Scottish Cup, and a, a League title. That's not great, considering he's been there, what, close to, what, seven, eight years now? Um, so he's got, like, three trophies out of a possible... I'm not going to count the European ones, but domestic trophies, he's got about, what, three trophies out of at least 21. Uh, that's poor. That is very poor, and I think James Tavernier will want to rectify that before he calls it a day. Anyway, guys, let us know your thoughts down below. Do you want to see Jam... Yeah, not Jam. <laughs> Who the fuck's Jam? Do you want to see James Tavernier leave? Do you think James Tavernier's time at Rangers is up? I know some people love the guy, some people hate the guy. I think that Rangers have got bigger issues than James Tavernier. I do not believe, when I look at the Rangers team, I, I can look at other positions that Rangers need to improve on before James Tavernier. So I don't really understand the hate. I get it, he's not the best defender, but I think he makes up for that. In terms of his ability to go forward, to set pieces, his dead ball ability, his goals, his contributions to assists, I think that that makes up for him being a not so good defender. Anyway, that's my opinion. Let me know your opinion down below. Catch you in the next one. Being Fog Football. Thanks for watching and peace.